Dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus, today, the 22nd of September, Holy Mother the Church celebrates the memory of St. Thomas of Villanova. St. Thomas of Villanova lived between 14th, 15th century. He is known to us as the father of almsgiving and the caretaker of the poor. He was born in Spain and there as he grew up, he grew up in faith and his father who was a miller was known for his almsgiving and that's where St. Thomas took that attitude of help towards poor. At the age of eight, 16, he joined the Augustinians, the hermit he joined and then later uh, he became a priest, he was ordained a priest. After his ordination, he was known much for his preaching and his writing. So much so that Charles V, the emperor, took a liking at him and would treat him as the counsellor of his kingdom. Charles V would often take the advice of St. Thomas. After which, St. Thomas was forcibly made the provincial of his congregation and as a provincial, he sent the first batch of missionaries to the uh, other countries, especially to Mexico, he said. And then he's, he was made the Bishop of Valencia. As Bishop of Valencia, first he led by his own example. He was very simple and he did not have any attachments to the things of the world. And then he also led his people in the same simplicity of faith. He tried to remove all kinds of things and negativities which were against the gospel of Christ. And he lived a life which he believed in. Dear brothers and sisters in Christ, St. Thomas of Villanova stands to us as an epitome of service, as an epitome of giving, as an epitome of duty and responsibility of being a good Christian. Every Christian is by nature a missionary. He was and he teaches us how to be. First, be convinced. Second, share your conviction. Third, stand for your conviction. Fourth, help others stand for their conviction. Be convinced, help others be convinced, stand for your conviction and help others to stand for their conviction. And that's how we can move towards the way of being true witnesses of the truth. Amen.